Hey guys, Ken Selville here today talking a little bit about uh, cedars and all the dead stuff that you find inside of them. It's a pretty common thing. You'll see that uh, most cedars do, uh, they shed the needles or the actual leaves uh, when they hit about three years old. So they keep the first year and the second year stuff, but then once they're about three years, they just start to shed some of that old stuff. So it tends to build up in the uh, hedge itself. So not a bad idea to get that cleaned out from time to time. The actual uh, uh, cedar bits and pieces are actually act as a natural mulch on the surface of the soil. And the cedars actually don't mind that. They kind of like that uh, to, you know, within a reasonable uh, amount. Uh, but it does build up excessively for sure. There's some cedars that just get absolutely overloaded and uh, in that case it actually becomes a fire hazard so you want to be a little bit careful with stuff uh, building up and you can see this cedar hedge here behind me has got quite a bit of dead stuff so it needs to be cleaned up here a little bit and uh, but that will all naturally fall so in the fall they shed a lot of stuff in every fall but they also just shed a little bit here and there through the season so using a rake to go through and just kind of brush it out or a big broom or something just to break it free and then scooping it all out from underneath is is really what you do so it's one of these things that uh, you should do periodically at least uh, about every three years or so just to uh, alleviate it building up too much becoming too much of a fire hazard ultimately that's what it is so uh, it's the way it goes with cedar hedges. You're going to have that uh, little chore ahead from time to time. The bigger they get, the more, obviously, the more you get. So <laughs> that's just the way that goes. Anyway, uh, thanks very much for tuning in. Just a quick tip on cedars today. So have a good one. Thanks for tuning in.